dominant and larger than life figure was equally respected and feared in the Ohio State community. This fear was related to his temper. For example, there were incidents where the coach attempted to strike a reporter during an interview, and on another occasion, he shoved a cameraman during the 1973 Rose Bowl. As he grew older, the game around him evolved, and his temper grew short. Well, this proved to be a disaster waiting to happen. On one fateful day in December, Ohio State found themselves trailing 15-17 in the 1978 Gator Bowl. As the game-altering play ended near the Ohio State sideline, Coach Hayes grabbed the Clemson linebacker and punched him in the upper chest and throat area. The strike itself caused no harm due to the Clemson player being fully equipped. However, the outburst caused a bench-clearing brawl that took several minutes to separate both parties. Legendary ABC announcer Keith Jackson that was calling the game did not see the initial strike, only the ensuing brawl due to his vantage point from the press box. However, all of America saw this unprecedented incident, including the Ohio State administration. The following day, the Board of Trustees, the administration, and the athletic director elected to remove Woody Hayes as their head coach.